So you guys remember how a few episodes back we were uh, talking how ridiculous we were talking about how ridiculous it would be for a uh, German uh, luxury sports sedan, the M5 V60 would would be to pull up to a place like Mount Takina and fucking do a time attack down it. Well, it's time to go even crazier. We got the V10. Oh, the V10. The best kind of engines are the V10. We got the Audi R8 Plus V10, 5.2 liter V10, and uh, oh yeah, it sounds like a beast. It's also surprisingly very uncontrollable for a all-wheel drive car, but you know, for all-wheel drive supercar. But as you can see, it's a good. It's it's the best drift car I've ever driven. But look at it, it's just sliding like it's nothing. Nice. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, I want to just uh, let's let's check out back to the pits. Let's see what kind of. Setup we're running. We got mount tack in it, yeah, whatever gears, whatever tires, semi slicks. We got semi slicks on this car, and it still really does not want to handle. You know, uh, it's gonna be fucking automatic. Um, uh, whatever. Like, let's uh, fucking lower the liters. I guess I don't know. Fucking whatever. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Uh, let's 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 drive. We 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 are here for the driving. So um. Let's get into position, the driving position. Look how it just fucking goes, slides, dude. It doesn't give a, f really doesn't care. Um, but yeah, let's let's go for our prelim preliminary run. Traction should be off. Traction is off, yes. And um, this car is the fastest car we've had on here. We go, we're going 170 right now, down the initial straight. The initial straight. Shout out to initial D. Um, this car, because of the speed, I need to be dri I need to drive it much more caref carefully uh, because it's just much faster, and uh, the speeds we that we're actually hitting are significantly larger, higher than um, than what we've hit before, especially since last. Oh no no yeah, just like. That, mm. Because of the speed, we don't have you know the same braking power as a. Uh, we, uh, I think we're running like we're not running ceramic brakes. I think we're running uh, drums on the back because the car really cannot stop for a shit. It cannot turn for shit. But I guess we are going 120. We want to take it over a fucking tight apex. I, I guess it does make sense. Just you know, you don't actually feel the speed, so it doesn't. I didn't know that I was going 160 until I looked down at the speedo. Um, yeah, but it's 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 going to be a hard it's going to be a hard thing. It, it understeers because you know all your drive uh, it's in theory all your drive it really doesn't act that much like an all your drive car except the understeer. So you know all the best parts are. I really thought I was going to make it, but it was a bad line, it was a bad line. Ooh. I was going 40 kilometers. I don't know about you, but I don't think a supercar should behave like that at 40 kilometers. I do fully understand going 160 over through some of these... Ooh, that was interesting, that was good, that was good. Oh. Fuck, that was a wall. Oh, heavy on the brakes. A bit too heavy there. Slight slide out. The cool thing about the R8, it's NA. It's, there's no turbos on it. There's no fake S turbos on it. It's NA, NA V10. Which I actually, I do. We gotta hit the brakes because we're not gonna make that turn. I do genuinely love turbos, but the problem with turbos on like exotic cars and whatnot, they muffle them so much that you don't even hear them. And the cool thing about turbos is the way they sound. You know, when you pull up a super and it starts fucking banging and fucking exploding, whooshy sounds and shit. 
and then you hear like a 488 GTB and there's nothing. It's just a V8, you know, it's, it's lackluster. And obviously the V8 is, I don't know. But the RS, the RS6, the last gen RS6, before this current gen, the, the 4.4, um, 4.4 twin turbo V8 is the newest gen and, uh, you know, it's a very cool car, but the last gen has a 5 litre twin turbo V10, dude, a 5 litre twin turbo V10. Forget about that fucking cheesy ass V8, dude, fuck that shit. But that's of the past. People are downgrading. There are no, uh, oh, there are no longer like the newest AMGs are four fucking liters, dude. Kind of. And this is okay. Our uh, initial run has been uh, cut short, so we're going on the second run immediately because uh, <coughs> bad maps, bad modding. Uh, this is not the fault of the. To some extent, it is the fault of the game for physics, but. I guess we're going to full attack. I have still not driven this car on the lower levels of this map. So uh, it should be interesting what we manage as a successful lap down Mount Akina with the R8. Nice, nice, nice. Slidey, slidey. Let's go, let's go. A bit in the... Drop a tire into the fucking grass, shit. Oh, nice. Fuck. I was tight, I was tight. Shit. You can see how my uh, commentary has gone completely mute because I am genuinely tryharding right now. Nice game, nice. Ooh, we going speedy, boy. Couldn't rotate the front end. Shit. Oh my god, I'm completely, completely focused into the game right now. I can't really. I'm not even talking, dude. What the fuck is life? What the fuck is commentary? We lost a lot of time there. Ooh. What are race cars? Oh, what is a race car suspension, dude? That was first. I don't know. Oh. I don't want to go into first in reality. That was a miss shift. What happened to my tires? Short shifting, apparently. Fucking hell. Not really, though. Oh my god. That's one way to take these turns. It's 
somehow we hit the, hit the wall. I really didn't think we should be able to hit the wall there, but whatever. Ooh. Man, these consecutive hairpins. There we go, there we go, there we go. Nice. Late turn in, late. No, that was way too late for a turn in there. Shit. Way too much speed into there. Way too much speed. Shit. That lost us a lot of time and a lot of realism <laughs> with it went. Let's go. This is a very deceptive turn, so we need to. Man, a second gear on this car, man. The second gear is ridiculous. How much? A 522. Oh my god. I don't even know if that's good. We gotta check out the leaderboards right now. Alright guys. Well this is the end of the episode. Thank you for watching very much. But before we leave. These are my. Uh, I think most of them. Or at least all of them. Uh, maybe all of them. All of my times on Mount Tack. And as you can see the Audi R8 is the second fastest car I've uh, I've got uh, I've had around this uh, this map. The it, it did a 522 and I can definitely go like much faster and I did a 5LM with a fucking with a 4AA GTB and uh, as you can see the the M3 uh, the M5 is really not that far behind with a 528 so uh, you know it's quite competitive it's quite competitive um, the RX7 535 still not that far away but you guys know, thank you for watching this episode and I'm gonna see you in the next one.